Good afternoon, Japan. Good afternoon, rest of the world. My name is Kaz. I'm a Japanese entrepreneur who recently moved to Singapore at the end of 2021. Today, I'm going to actually talk about eBay Japan's new feature called Market Report. eBay Japan recently added to their own setup portal. And then uh, if you are based in Japan and you are selling the product to the eBay.com or rest of the eBay market, this uh, market report is very, very useful to find out uh, what are the top selling products, uh, where are the demands on eBay. So that I'm going to actually show you how to use this report and also how you can also utilize this report along with the therapy uh, research tool. So if you are interested in today's video, let's get started. Okay, so before I started today's video, and yesterday um, I also uh, made a video about the eBay recent change about EDD display. So if you haven't watched my video, I put the link down below on the description area so that please make sure you read about it because if you are a seller on eBay, you need to optimize your EDD. So please make sure you check my description, okay? All right, so let's get started today's video. So, okay, so I'm currently logging into the eBay Japan Seller Portal page. So if you are using on eBay and then, uh, you know, if you want to know the useful information about how to sell on eBay, make sure you add eBay Japan Seller Portal to your favorite on bookmark so that uh, you can get a bunch of different information or recent news about selling on eBay. Anyway, uh, right now, if you go to log into the uh, seller portal, there is a new menu called Market Report. So if you click that, uh, you, it's gonna actually show uh, these kind of report. So what are the market reports? Market reports basic, basically divided by into two sections. So the, um, they're gonna actually set in the uh, monthly hot selling brand or uh, item by category, also by month. And then uh, you can also see the market on eBay uh, US and also that uh, outside the US market. So that's very handy. And then uh, you can also see the top selling keywords, uh, monthly selling volume, and also the, uh, the total uh, transaction volume. So that's also very, very important because these are some of the information that you can uh, get that through therapy so that uh, you really need to look at them by utilizing these reports. And then uh, you can also see the, uh, the searches, not just by the Japanese sellers, but also you can see the uh, total numbers on eBay.com site. And then, uh, yeah, so that you can basically, the, the way that we can expect you to use these reports is to see the demands and trend. So that, uh, you, know, you know, when you don't know what kind of category, or product you are going to sell on eBay, you want to make sure that whatever the product or category we pick, you want to make sure that there's a demand on eBay. So by looking at these reports, uh, you can basically look at where uh, the customers are, you know? So I'm gonna actually show you a couple of reports as, as an example. So it, uh, the, this report actually breaking down into the, these uh, pie charts and then uh, it's very easy to see these reports and then the, these reports can be, uh, you can download by clicking uh, each uh, download button and then the, the, all the reports can be categorized by each major category. So I'm gonna actually look at the uh, jewelry section and then download a jewelry report and uh, this is the, actually the, the download report, uh, jewelry report I just downloaded, you know. So now it's showing the uh, 2022 February uh, jewelry and watches. So these are the popular brands sold by the Japanese seller. And then the, you can see the, uh, the largest one is gonna be uh, Omega, Seiko, Tiffany, Cartier, Britain, Tag Heuer, you know? So these are the actually the uh, watch brand sold by the Japanese seller. And then the, these are the, some of the uh, high number of the listings sold by the brand. And then the, they are Seiko, Tiffany, Omega, Cartier, Tag Heuer, Virgin, uh, uh, Chanel. So these are the top number of the listings sold by the Japanese e-seller. 
And then uh, these are the brand price range. Omega is 3000 plus is probably the, uh, the most. And then, uh, you know, these are some of the uh, price range. Uh, Seiko and Tiffany coach here. And then uh, these are the actual the buyers uh, search keywords by search volume and also the transaction volume. And then uh, it's the category is actually the watch and this is the, actually the category number. And then, uh, you know, the Lorex of course is number one and it's a very high uh, search volume and also the transaction volume. And then the next one is going to be watch, Seiko, Lorex, and Tag Heuer. So that, um, you know, so now what I can do is now by looking at these reports, I can visualize what kind of keywords the uh, buyers are searching. So for example, Tag Heuer. Uh, actually, we can, I can go to the uh, therapy sections and then the paste the tag higher and then the quick search. And then the, it actually show you all the uh, tag higher watch being sold and then you also go to the more filters and then you can also select the seller country, Japan, right? There are actually 373 uh, transactions in the last 30 days. So these are the actual tag higher watches being sold by the Japanese seller. So the, if you click that, the, all the uh, listings is actually based in Japan, you know? So these are the actually the product. So what I just did was, I don't know anything about tag higher. I just basically reference what are the top selling keywords in the watch and jewelry category. And then I just pick uh, some of the keyword and copy and paste, and then the actually went to the chair peak and then paste in search, and then also filtered by seller country Japan to make sure that uh, what the Japanese sellers are actually selling these tag, tag higher watches. So this is very helpful. It's a combination of the report and the chair peak, so that even though you don't have any idea what kind of products are popular in each eBay key category. By looking at the seller market report, you can actually visualize each keyword by search volume and also the transaction volume. And then you can start do the more in-depth uh, research by using the therapy. So I think it's very powerful by using this report and also the therapy research. Okay, that's very, very good. So I'm going to give you one more quick example. Um, so if I go back to the eBay page, I'm going to look at the sales. You know, there are so many different categories. Okay, let's go to the uh, trading card. You know, okay, now it's a trading card. Uh, same thing. Uh, I'm not going to explain, but the, you know, but these are the same thing. Pokemon, Star Wars, uh, Magic and Gathering, uh, Transformers, Marvel. Yu-Gi-Oh! So these are the actually the keywords so by the sales, by the also the number of the listing. And these are the actually the keywords, the buyer search keywords on eBay. And then the, you can see the transaction volume and also the sales volume. So the same thing, you can kind of look at the, some of the uh, keywords, so the PSA Pokemon. So what is the PSA Pokemon? And then the, you can actually go to therapy and then the search uh, PSA Pokemon, right? And uh, you see some of the listings for PSA Pokemon, and you can actually go to uh, filter down by uh, Japanese uh, setup. So that's that's the the way that you should be able to use these reports to uh, search the product, you know. And also, uh, what, I, what else you can do is to source the product on uh, Japanese e-commerce. So if you know these keywords have been searched by international buyer, you can search these keywords on Japanese sourcing sites such as uh, Yahoo Auction, Rakuten, or Amazon, or any other uh, sourcing sites online, offline, so that you can kind of uh, start finding the product to sell. Also, you can also use the Google uh, Trend or Google Keyword. So you can also combine other third-party software to see uh, the, the demand, right? So, you know, you know what the key, what keywords the buyers are looking on eBay, and then you can use these keywords and it's uh, finding the uh, sourcing in the Japanese platform, stores, and then, you know, offline, online, so that you can kind of uh, find a profitable product. Anyway, 
I think this uh, eBay Japan, I really appreciate what the eBay Japan is doing. Uh, this is super valuable because uh, I have been running a uh, Terapeak before eBay acquired uh, Terapeak. So I'm a data guy, you know, so that, um, you know, I know how valuable and important to conduct the business uh, data driven eBay listing. So it's, it's very important, okay? So uh, yeah, it's anyone can use, it's free to use. So make sure you go to ebay.co.jp and log in to set up portal and then click the market report and then uh, you can access to uh, these reports and you know, it's up to you. Uh, you're gonna take advantage of these reports. Anyway, uh, if you enjoyed uh, today's video and if you think today's video is uh, helpful, uh, please thumbs up. And then uh, I hope you subscribe my channel and then click the notification bell so that you get notified when I upload new video. And then please follow my Twitter because I'm talking about the life in Singapore. And then uh, I'm going to make more uh, useful video regarding the eBay in an upcoming video. So that I hope I see you guys tomorrow. Bye.